Hello there, it's me, it's Dean, and yes, you were watching Dean's Brick Show. I just want to say thank you for joining me, and if you haven't done so already, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button, and also hit that bell so you can be notified with all my future releases. Alrighty, today we are going to be reviewing this little nutcracker here. Um, this set um, came out in 2017, and uh, what is unique about this set that um, it wasn't um, a Lego set that was for sale in stores or anything. This was um, an employee uh, gift. Um, every year, Lego will give their employees a Christmas gift, a unique Lego set, if you will. And this was the set uh, that came out in uh, 2017. And uh, what makes this set um, kind of special is that in 2017, when it came out, it at that time, it was the 40th anniversary of the Lego uh, Technic set. Um, the Lego Technic set uh, first came out in 1977. So to uh, comm commemorate the 40th anniversary, um, they uh, made this um, Nutcracker set out of mostly Technic pieces. And uh, like I said, this was a Christmas gift for uh, Lego employees. So we're just going to take a little bit of, uh, of a closer look at this. And, um, and I'm going to read you a little something um, from the instruction manual. Um, a little backstory about uh, Lego and Lego Technic. And um, yeah, then I'll show you um, uh, some of the box art and we'll just take a little bit closer look at this Nutcracker himself. He has a few um, movable uh, pieces, if you will, um, on this set as well. So let's dive into this. Um, first up, I'm going to show you this um, photo in the back of the instruction manual. Um, this here is a uh, photo um, of what I'm assuming um, was the first Lego, an ad for the first Lego Technic set back in 1977. And as you can tell, um, it's definitely 1977 by the clothes uh, this person is wearing. And um, I'm pretty sure in 1977, this was pretty a pretty advanced uh, Lego Technic set, um, but by today's standards, it is not. Uh, but nonetheless, it's a pretty cool looking uh, vintage ad here, and I'm glad they put it um, in the back of the Lego uh, manual, if you will. Okay, so I'm going to read a little bit here um, about um, this particular set. 85 years ago, a young Danish carpenter, Ole Kirk Christensen, began supplementing his traditional carpentry work by creating a range of wooden toys in his workshop. Thus, the company we know as the Lego Group was born. Though there may seem to be little in common between those first simple wooden toys and the building sets we create today, it is in spirit of Ole Kirk's self-coined and uncompromising motto, only the best is good enough that continues to guide us as a company. Fast forward to 1977 and the release of the first Lego technical set. The Lego Technic story began when a handful of Lego designers wanted to build a larger models um, full of realistic technical functions. They experimented with interconnecting cross beams, axles, and cog wheels, soon creating a new and advanced Lego building system. 40 years and approximately 400 sets later, Lego Technic, as it was named in the early 1980s, remains one of the most popular and enduring product lines in the Lego range. These two strands of Lego history come together in this year's Christmas model. It pays homage to those first Lego wooden toys and celebrates the 40th anniversary of Lego Technic while adding a touch of traditional Christmas with its chosen theme. The Nutcracker 
is a fairy tale set on Christmas Eve. It follows the adventures of a young girl and her valiant nutcracker doll that comes alive, defeats evil enemies, and whisks her away to a magical kingdom. Originally written in 1816, it was later adapted by Alexandre Dumas and transformed into a famous ballet with music by Tchaikovsky. We hope you and your family will enjoy hours of fun building and playing with this very special Lego model that was set uh, 4002017. Um, like I said, um, every year Lego comes out with a, an employee exclusive uh, Lego set. Um, and as far as I know, all the sets start with 400 followed by the year. So, like I said, this is 4002017. Uh, this came out in 2017. Um, so that's an easy way to look for these sets um, online if you uh, wanted to purchase some secondhand or through a second market like eBay. Uh, we can just search Lego set 4002017. Um, so yeah, there's a, you know there's a Star Wars one uh, that might have came out in 2015 or 2016. Um, and that one is quite expensive. Um, one of the more popular Lego sets for, um, for employees. Um, it might be like right now valued like a, over a thousand dollars. So it's a little steep, but it's a really cool set. Uh, it's got an X-Wing made in all kinds of uh, fun, festive Christmas colors. Um, and this particular set um, only has 732 pieces. Um, it doesn't look like it, but it is. Um, a lot of small little pieces here. So, um, yeah, again, pretty exciting little set. Um, I kind of like the the ones that are uh, more Christmas themed, if you will. I, not all of their employee sets are Christmas themed. Um, but I'm, I'm really glad that this one was. Otherwise, I probably wouldn't have uh, purchased it. Um, so, yeah. Um, and that's all I have for you guys today. I just want to say thank you for joining me. And remember, it's a big world out there. Brick it up. Good night. Thank you.